make to my Kanish video, huh? Whoa. <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Hi, my name is Andrea. I'm a Take Shape for Life health coach. And uh, all of my links are down below if you want to know more about the Metafast Food or the Take Shape for Life program. You can talk to me about anything. You don't have to be my client, whatever. I talk to everybody. I talk to everybody. I'm on YouTube. <laughs> Yay. I'm going to do the mashed potatoes again. I'm not going to do the sour cream and chive. I'm going to do the garlic. I'm not going to use my uh, baby cakes donut maker. I'm not going to make them the way they're supposed to be made. I am going to do another, another variable. Just last night, Leah posted that she was in the mood for the mashed potatoes. And somebody, I'm sorry that I didn't take note of her name, but somebody came up with a brilliant idea. Brilliant! Pickle juice. Ooh, pickle juice. I love pickle juice. I love pickles. These are really garlicky. These are zesty garlic. Hi. Spears. I like spears. Are these spears? I'm going to do is I'm going to pot. Anyway, um, potato pancakes, okay? I'm using my big mama jama frying pan in there. Um, you do need to add some binder to this in order to make it work. Now, when I made it in the donut maker, I used egg whites. But I ran out of my egg whites because then I made a casserole a couple of days later. So this is just straight egg substitute. Um, this counts. This counts as some lean. Some of your lean. This is some of your lean. A quarter of a cup of this is one egg. On your meatless options, this is for your lean, okay? Three whole eggs. It's not the leanest that you can do. It's just lean, okay? Three whole eggs is one lean. So this is gonna count as a third of your lean and green. This is on days when you need something. When you need something, you know? Um, we could go into the math of the egg beaters because it's it's like the same as egg beaters, but I'm not gonna, just count it as a third of your lean, okay? It smells very garlicky. It's, it's delicious. I love the mashed potatoes. Again, I'm retracting again that bad Friday night pissy that I did a couple months ago where I just, I was so angry at Metafest about the mashed potatoes and God damn it, I really like them. Quarter of a cup of egg beaters. Now how much pickle juice? I'm afraid that I'm not gonna put enough in that it's not gonna taste like anything. And then I'm also afraid that I'm gonna put too much and it's gonna be nutritionally wacky. One serving of this is a spear. Um, I don't think that I'm going to count this as a snack because, thank you, Debbie. Okay. In the sauces and syrups, vinegar is there. This is just vinegar. I'm not actually eating the pickle itself. I'm not eating the little mustard seeds or anything like that. I'm just going to use the juice. So I'm going to count this as a condiment. I think I could go either way. If you end up having a little bit more condiment, then count it as a snack. I don't know. I'm going to count it as a condiment because I'm only using juice. I'm not using actual food, okay? So I'm not going to count it as balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar has a much higher sugar content than regular vinegar does. Regular vinegar has pretty much none. I'm curious as to why it's only two tablespoons. Vinegar actually doesn't have that much sodium in it in itself. A lot of things are prepared with vinegar and salt with it. But just straight vinegar, I love vinegar. I can kind of drink vinegar which I know is gross, um, but it says just two tablespoons. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two tablespoons of pickle juice into my quarter cup measuring cup. It ends up being about half of that. And then I'm going to fill the rest up with water because I need half a cup of liquid in this thing. Does that The fact sense? that I'm using garlic mashed potatoes and garlic pickle juice, nobody's going to So I'm mixing this up. It smells so garlicky. Oh my God. <laughs> it's like crazy garlicky. Okay. This looks so good. It looks so good. I should have used a fork. I should have fluffed it with a fork, but that's it. Fluffed it? Wow. Do you know what a fluffer is? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh... Sexual innuendo is my middle name, baby. Okay, this is um, this is perfect. This is gonna make such a nice two or three pancakes. I'm probably gonna make three with this. All right, let me heat up the pan. Stop and chop everything. Do you see what I have there? Only bad witches are ugly. It's very true. Dorothy.
favorite movie of all time. My first favorite movie ever. When I was four years old, I knew every word to this movie. Crazy. Okay. So this is uh, nice and heated up. This thickened as I was heating up the pan. So I would uh, recommend... I would recommend that you uh, let this sit for three or four minutes before you actually make the pancakes so that they thicken up, um, you know, so that the, the potatoes rehydrate because you're cooking this in a different way than it's formulated to be cooked. Um, these are going to be awesome. Oh, I feel like it yeah. can come. You know what my husband and I get? We get roasted garlic cloves and then we put them on top of pizza. When I'm not doing Metafast. He grinds them up, he gets roasted garlic cloves and he grinds them up and we just have chunks of garlic on our pizza because it's just he and I and then, you know, we can kiss. Right? They're a little tough to flip, I have to admit. I've that done this before, well. not with the pickle juice, the pickle juice is a new thing. I've done this before, I really felt like it needed cheese. I love to dip and I love to, I, I love, um, I, I like cheese. Oh, cheese is so good. I really do love cheese. But you know, we're, we've already added the pickle juice. We've already added the, the quarter of a cup of egg. We don't want to get too crazy. I'm out of the shot. I can go out of the shot either way. I go either way. Okay. <laughs> Let's, uh, have you ever seen anything so fabulous as that? You see the steam coming off of it? I rock. Oh my God. All right. It's still cooking itself. Holy shit. I'm a genius. Look at that. This one didn't come out so great. <laughs> this one is a little stuck. It smells awesome. It smells awesome. Wow. Woo! <laughs> okay. Hot. I let it sit okay. for a minute, minute and a half. This is delicious. I'm not sure the pickle juice is worth it. I gotta be honest. Okay, the pickle juice added a little bit of saltiness to it, which is nice. Um, it needed a little bit of salt. It needed just a little more flavor um, because I, I told you, I've done this before. If you are willing to give up one of your snacks, you could take um, a cheese stick and crumble it up in there or some shredded cheese or something. Or as one of your healthy fats. The pickle is nice. I wish it was time for me to eat. <laughs> as if I didn't just eat. Because I would just plow through these. And it's like a lot of food. This is like more substance than the pancakes. Well, obviously, because you've got a quarter of a cup of um, egg whites in there or egg beaters, whatever. Um, this is heavier than regular pancakes or Metafast pancakes. This is heavier than some of the other foods. I love the mashed potatoes. I love the mashed potatoes. I love the mashed potatoes. Thank you so much, Metafast. I really do appreciate you coming out with these mashed potatoes. Um, if anything, it's going to give people more uh, motivation to stay on, on plan, okay? Um, so this is pickle flavored garlic mashed potatoes. I can't say that is pickle flavored. That's ridiculous. Um, it's just it's super garlic flavored mashed potatoes uh, because I use the garlic pickle juice. It's not necessary. You don't need to use the pickle juice. If you used more pickle juice, then maybe, but then you're bumping into more condiments on your, you know, allotted amount. You got to be careful with these things. These things add up. Trust me on this. I know just what I'm talking about. Be cool with your add-ons. Okay, so all of my links are down below in the description box. You can email me. You can friend me on Facebook. You can follow me on Instagram. You, you can, can contact me anytime you want, day or night. If I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping. You're not going to wake me up. I turned my phone off. Um, I hope you all have a fantastic day.